In southern Lebanon, a Syrian refugee family has found shelter in this abandoned farmhouse. My Sada's husband, Hassan, works in the banana plantations that surround the house. In return, the owner lets them live here. Their story is all too familiar. The family fled Idlib, Syria, six months ago when their neighborhood was bombed. Once in Lebanon, Maisara heard that UNHCR distributes aid to Syrian refugees. She went to the nearest registration center in the city of Saidan. Here, hundreds of families are registered. Today, it is Maisara and Hassan's turn. When their number is called, the process begins. For so many of the families here, recounting their stories is still very painful. Over 250 people are registered at this center in Saidan every day. When a family is deemed especially vulnerable, like this one, the process is accelerated. There was a lot of clashes in the area that they were living in. And the husband basically died there. This case is very critical. It's a young mother between 17 to 18 years. She has three children under the age of three. So the first recommendation for her is to get a shelter. Caritas, a Lebanese UNHCR partner, helps find homes for the vulnerable refugees. ID papers are handed out. My Sarah and her family will now receive monthly aid packages. My Sarah finds hope wherever she can. Her oldest son has just started a training program in a sewing factory and her youngest son has been admitted to the local school. All small comforts which make the family's life in exile easier to bear. <laughs>